Hi, my name is Jemima Chole and I'm ten and a half years old. Did you know that some girls in Africa and around the world face many challenges that makes it hard for them to go to school, dream big, and be happy? Today, I'm speaking with the former president of Liberia, Ellen Johnson Sirleaf, and the World Bank's vice president of Western and Central Africa, Usman Diagana, on supporting girls to help us succeed. My first question goes to you, Madame Sirleaf. As the first female president in Africa, were you ever scared to be president of Liberia? And what is your advice to girls like me to overcome our fears? As a young girl, as you are now, um, I think I spoke up every now and then in class, just like you're doing, so to get opportunities like you to talk to others. I got way past my fear, I had no more fear, so I, I was able then to take the leadership of the country and provide me with the opportunities to be able to do things for girls like you. Know that you can do it. Thank you, that was very inspiring. My second question goes to you, Mr. Diagana. How can men support women and girls? My mother who has never been in school, and I'm a young brother of a sister who was first in my family to go to school. And when I saw my mother so proud of the achievement of my big sister's school, and therefore myself and those in my, my generation have started to organize some very specific training activities for everybody, but in particular for girls. Thank you, Mr. Diogana. My last question goes to you both. What was your dream or ambition when you're my age? And can you say that you have achieved it now? When I was your age, I didn't think I would be president. I hadn't planned for it. I thought I would be a teacher like my mother. But it didn't take me long when I got into a classroom to start to be very active, to take positions. It was easy on that road that I achieve one step after another. So that after today, you will be looking to see when is my next interview. And you'll find yourself wanting to open the paths for your success and for your leadership. As a young boy, my dream was really to be a teacher uh, because I've always been very negative of how a teacher can help a young man or a young girl. First, you have to say yourself, the sky should be the limit. You know, I went to school in, in Mauritania. Today, I'm the vice president of the World Bank. So it's not impossible. Reach out to others. Mm -hmm. Nobody can become successful all, all alone. Mm -hmm. So reach out to friends. Have those who you like, who support you, and those whom you support as you carry on yourself. Thank you. Thank you for both coming today. I learned a lot. Yeah.